Hello guys, welcome to Web Design for Course. In this tutorial, we're going to make uh, an application board and select a video as a background of our website page for the tools. And we can go ahead inside the VS Code editor and design it by this file and HTML file as well. So inside the HTML file, we have got the two uh, files as CSS and uh, HTML. For this one, we have got uh, the basic uh, elements. Uh, we can add it. Uh, as dark type HTML, we can uh, delete this one and at the um, this uh, we can uh, call this uh, tutorial by the name of uh, background uh, video. So now we should uh, link this uh, HTML with the uh, CSS file. For this one, we have got uh, style dot css we can select this one inside the body element we are going to make a hero element before this we have got a dot hero for this one inside this div element we can add um, some na titles uh, and a video for this one at the first we can add nav element inside this nav we have got the ul element inside we are going to make a title for this one it's just possible to do by the uh, list element for this one we can uh, write the uh, li tag e tag element uh, and each uh, is a one number and we can uh, call the first uh, navigation title by the name of uh, home for the for this one and we can duplicate this uh, And uh, we can call the second one by the name of online course. And uh, for that one, we can call this one the free tutorial. And the last one, uh, we can duplicate this one. And we can call this one by the name of our registration. We can call the last one by the name of contact title. So now we should go ahead inside this install.css and design it uh, just by this file. So we can now make a second uh, title by the name of explorer for this one. We have got the content. But the first we can write on dot content and inside this one we have got each tag element e one element we can write on web design and we can add uh, element by an e tag element the number is a uh, we can select uh, we can uh, link to this uh, attack element as a number and we can write on it uh, by the name explore that you are going to explore this uh, total web design total with another uh, for a uh, page so now we should go ahead inside the css part we have got the basic code as a store inside the set we can zero down margin should be zero and padding should be zero for this band and font family should uh, be and uh, list style should be now for So let's go make a design a hero element. It's just possible we can write down a dot and copy this hero from HTML file and we can paste and open the set before the weights of this hero should be 100%. Which is a uh, font size is a uh, height size 
and position you can select its position should be absolute for this one and uh, padding space on the top and bottom should be 0, 0 and 5 pixel and display should be flex for this one and align item should uh, be in the center of the navigation bar and justify content, just content we can select the XS file content should be the center of the page so go ahead and right now open the set we have got the navigation bar its width should be 100 percent and the position of this nav bar should be absolute and top uh, space 0 and the left space uh, from the left of the page should be 10 pixel and padding space should be 20 pixel and 8 pixel for this one so go ahead then let's uh, design its uh, align item align item should be center of the speech and uh, justify content should be as well for this one we can write them justify content should be space between so go ahead write down nav ul li open the set for this one the list style should be now we can select this list and display should be and then inline block you can select it and margin space from the left you can select the margin space from the left we can select 40 pixel for this one so go ahead and write down nav ULLRA open the set for this one we have got the uh, this nav ULLI and its color should be a white color and the font size should be font size should be 18 pixel and the text decoration should be nah, you can select its uh, decoration as an we can uh, design content we have got the content element can write down dot uh, and uh, copy this content from the HTML file. Paste here. Open the set for this one. We have got the uh, text align. Text align should be for the content is uh, center. Can select and uh, we have got. Can copy this and content dot content. Open. You can paste here and uh, open the set for designing each one element. Font size should be uh, 150-165% pixel for this one and we can select this color this color should be a white color and uh, font width uh, we can select its font width 600 pixel for this one and go ahead you can paste uh, dot content attack element you can design this attack element is text decoration should be land and display should uh, for this one we can select an inline line block for this one and we can select this color as RGB color for this one we can write down RGB open the set for this one and we can delete this RGB color we can select 140 54 and uh, for this one 
and 129 as RGB color and uh, we have got uh, this color and font size uh, for this one we can select uh, 24 pixel we can select a spoon size and border space uh, we have got border 2 pixel we can select this border uh, should be solid uh, as RGB color for this one we have got RGB open the set so inside uh, open the bracket inside the bracket we can select 219 or 129 is the code of the color we can select for this attack element is border color and padding space should be uh, 14 pixel and uh, 70 pixel you can select this padding space from the top and the bottom of this page so border I've got the border radius we are gonna to make uh, me bring a change for this one to change the rectangle to the rectangle and uh, for them we, have, we can we can select this one as a 50 pixel and uh, we have got the margin from the top space so we can select the margin top should be 20 pixel for this one so go ahead inside the HTML file and add uh, some element as a video element for this one we have got this element a video element inside the video element you can write down how to play in line so class is equal back hyphen video so we have got uh, this element as a video we are going to make to add uh, some uh, video inside as a video element it's just possible by source element we can write on source uh, and inside this source we can write the uh, source uh, source equal inside the uh, uh, image folder we have got uh, a video by the name of banner as mp4 format if you are going to turn, add some video you can uh, at the first you can uh, copy and paste the uh, video inside the folder we can call that folder by the image and now you should copy this back with you go to inside the uh, sys file and write down dot back with you open the set position should be absolute right should be right space should be zero and the bottom uh, space should be zero and site index for this one we can select hyphen one so go ahead uh, inside the css file we can write an add media open the set bracket can write a main hyphen aspect hyphen code you can see write on 16 per 9 so open the set we can write on dot back with you 
open the set we can select its uh, width size for it uh, we can select it as 100 percent is width size and uh, uh, we can select its height size we can select uh, for this one uh, we can select out. so now we should copy this video enter under this we can uh, write pista can change this one this one to max and the weight size should be the max aspect should be auto oops one and the high size should be for this one can change to 100 which uh, for this one so now we should uh, save this CSS file this HTML file and run the program if you run the program so we can uh, run the program you can see the change we have created uh, this uh, navigation bar as the web uh, as the website page i've selected this video as the background of this website page the website uh, design is the explore we can select this one and this tutorial is the navigation bar as a menu bar and uh, you can select different types of uh, uh, video as a mp4 format thanks for your watching please subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video